Mazagada, redege de brozigra gada gada. Mezigra gada, brozigre gede gede gede. Mezendege de brogada gada gada. Mezendege de brogada gada gada gada. Mezigra gada 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 gada. Mezigra gada 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 gada. Lege de brozigra gada grege de grege de gede gede gede. Ragrege de gede 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 gede. Mazanda grege de bruzigra gada grege de gede gede. Magra gada gra gada 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 gada. Regrege de grege de gede 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 gede. Ragada grege de bruzigra gada 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 gada. Mezigra gada rezigra gada grege de gede gede gede. Ragrege de gede 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 gede. Mazagada, Brozigra gada gada gada, Rezigra gada, Mose grege de gede gede. Mazagada, Brozigra gada 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 gada. Thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus. Mezigra gada, Brozigra gada 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 gada. Mezigra gada, Brozigra gada gada gada. Mege de gede 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 gede. Mege de gede 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 gede. Mazagra gada, brozigra gada, gede gede. Mezigra gada, brozigra gada. Mezu gada, magre gede, zugra gada, bro gede gede gede. Magra gada, brozigra gada, gede gede. Magre gede, brozigra gada, gada gada gada. Lezigra gada, brozigra gada, brozigra gada 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 gada. Lezigra gada, brozigra gada 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 gada. Mezigra gada, brozigra gada 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 gada. Lezegre gede 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 gede. Mezegre gede bro gada 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 gada. Mezegre gede bro gada 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 gada. Father, we thank you. Father, we give you the glory. Father, we thank you. Father, we give you the glory. Father, we thank you. Father, we give you the glory. We give you the glory. Mazagada, bro, gede, 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 gede. Mazagada, bro, gede, 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 gede. Magragada, bro, zigragada, bro, zigragada, gada, gada, gada. Mazagragada, bro, zigragada, gada, 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 gada. Let zigragada, bro, gede, 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 gede. Magragada, bro, zigragada, bro, zigragada, gada, 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 gada. Mezege de mogada mogede gede 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 gede. Mazagra gada brozi gra gada. Mazagra gada brozi gra gada gada gada. Lezege de bro gada 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 gada. Mezege de bro gada 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 gada. Mezege de bro gada 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 gada. Magra gada bro gede 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 gede. Mazagra gada brozi gra gada 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 gada. Mezi gada, brozi gada, gada, gada. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen and amen. God bless you, God bless you, God bless you all um, for making time to join us once again tonight on the hour of groaning. Let me just reduce my... Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God bless you all once again uh, for joining uh, um, me tonight on the hour of groaning. Amen. An hour of an hour of intensive prayers. Amen. God bless you. You've done very well for making time. I know Sundays Sundays are, are, are very, very busy nights, amen. And so for you um, to make time to join tonight, I, I don't take it lightly at all, amen. And as I, as I always say, if I don't take it lightly, then it means that God is also impressed um, uh, with you for making time to um, join us tonight to pray. Prayers are very, very, very important in a believer's life. Amen. In fact, prayer, I, I like one thing that our senior pastor always says, uh, Bishop Francis Sapa will always tell you that ministry is prayer. Ministry is prayer. Ministry is prayer. And so there's a song that we sing that says that Jesus started his ministry with prayer and he ended with prayer. Praise the Lord. So life is all about prayer. 
Right in the beginning of Genesis, uh, we see God making declarations. It's a form of prayer. We see God making declarations right at the beginning uh, of scriptures. Amen. And then things began to fall in place. Uh, things began to fall in place as God was making declarations uh, in Genesis chapter 1. Amen. That shows you the importance of declaration. And that is what prayer is. I mean, when we are praying, we are making declarations. We are programming things to manifest in the physical realm. And as you have joined tonight, whatever you declare tonight, uh, may it be so for you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Uh. Oh, I said that whatever you declare tonight will be established for you in the mighty name of Jesus. So on behalf of Bishop Francis Sapon, on behalf of our Bishop Francis Sapon, the First Lady, Reverend Elizabeth Sapon, and our current president, uh, Reverend Edwin Otain, I welcome you all to the hour of groaning, an hour of intensive prayers. Uh, God bless you. We are dealing with limitations. We are dealing with limitations um, this month of August because that's what the Lord laid upon my heart for us to deal with. Amen. Amen. It's the sign that God wants to set somebody free. God wants to intervene in somebody's life. Amen. What is a limitation? Uh, this is a, a definition I have here. It's a spiritual embargo imposed on somebody in order to prohibit the person or prevent the person. I say it again. Uh, amen. What is a limitation? Limitation is a spiritual embargo. A spiritual embargo imposed on somebody in order to prohibit the person or to prevent the person from uh, fulfilling uh, their divine purpose. Divine, very important, divine purpose. In other words, God's will for your life. God's will for your life. Amen. And many people are not fulfilling it. Many people are not fulfilling God's uh, agenda for their lives. Many people are not. Amen. Amen. Which I believe that's the reason why God laid this topic on my heart for us to spend time throughout the month of August to deal with limitation. And, 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 and this week, uh, we are going to have prayer of Jabez on Tuesday on Zoom. In addition to prayer of Jabez on Tuesday on Zoom, uh, on Thursday, we have a special summer edition of prayer of Jabez in person. And then on Thursday, we uh, from, from this Thursday, coming Thursday, 11 to the 1st of September, in other words, every Thursday to the 1st of September, we will have prayer of Jabez in person. And then we will meet at prayer temple. The Lord laid upon my heart that we need to address this thing. We need to address it before we enter the month of September. Amen. And so that's why um, the Lord laid upon my heart that we should have a, a special summer edition of prayer of Jabez in person. Why we meet in person at 11 a.m. at our headquarters in East London. Amen. East India Dock Road. London E14 6DF. London E14 6DF. Amen. We are going to meet in person and again we are going to be addressing this thing amen, throughout the month of August. Seriously. And by the time we enter September, your life will never be the same again. So please book time off work. Make time for it. Amen. It, 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 it will not take away the, uh, the Zoom one. The Zoom, the Zoom one will also go on on Tuesdays. Amen. So we are not canceling the Zoom one. Amen. The Zoom one on Tuesdays will still go ahead. Amen. And in, in addition to that, we will have prayer of Jabez in person, summer edition, special summer edition. This Thursday coming at our headquarters. It's going to be in person only. The Tuesday one will be on Zoom. But the Thursday is going to be in person only. I mean, the reason why I said that is I don't want to have any, uh, I don't want to be, um, Try, I, I don't want to try to figure out how to set up um, whatever YouTube for people to join and all that. Amen. So it's going to be in person only. It's going to be in person only on Thursdays. Amen. Amen. On Thursday, um, uh, 11th of Thursday, this coming Thursday. Amen. Till the 1st of September. Every Thursday till the 1st of September. Amen. There are going to be four, there are going to be four sessions. Amen. It's a special summer edition. Amen. At our headquarters. Please come. Uh, come. Uh, Sometimes these things, you have to buy your ticket and come. 
you have to come by train regardless of where you are and buy your tickets fly in uh, i know somebody who's done that before the person came from ireland and then and they broke through they were having serious challenges with marriage they broke through. another one who came from denmark and she also broke through Amen. Sometimes these things you have to go out of your way. Amen. So please don't forget um, um, prayer of Jabez in person. Special summer edition this coming Thursday. It starts this coming Thursday at 11 a.m. at our headquarters. Please tell somebody. Now, if you can, please uh, fast on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Amen. But don't fast on the Thursday because you need your energy to pray. So we are going to be fasting on, on, on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Amen. Uh, if, if you are on uh, any medication, don't fast. I mean, if you're on medication, don't fast. If you are pregnant, also don't fast. And sometimes, even if you are breastfeeding, also um, try not to fast. Amen. Uh, if doctors have also told you to not to fast, then don't fast. Amen. But spend more time praying. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we are going to be praying and fasting. Amen. Towards um, Thursday. Amen. Prayer of Jabez in person, in person only at 11 a.m. at our headquarters. Please make time to be there. Even if you can't get there, you know somebody who has been limited in life, send them there. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. Amen. It's going to be awesome. That's why we are fasting and praying towards it. Amen. Please make time to be there and your life uh, will never be the same again. Uh, amen. So we are dealing with limitation tonight. Limitation tonight is a spiritual embargo imposed on somebody in order to prevent them, in order to prohibit them. Amen. And tonight, any spiritual embargo, any spiritual embargo placed upon your life, I break and destroy it in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, now it's easy to understand what a spiritual embargo is there because of what is happening to Russia right now. I mean, I want to use that to explain what I mean. And then because Russia invaded Ukraine, um, most of the Western countries and some countries from Asia have imposed an embargo on Russia. Amen. The idea is to is to suffocate their economic system and restrict them. That's what limitation is. Restrict them so that they cannot go on with the war. So that they cannot go on with the war. Amen. And that's what the spiritual embargo is. That there are any places on you to restrict you. The idea is to restrict Russia so that at some point they will give up. Amen. And some of us, that's how our lives are. Something has been placed upon your life. Um, you may not be aware of it, but it's there. Amen. Uh, you might be doing well in some areas of your life, but you look at some other areas and you can see there's, there's something that the enemy is doing to restrict you. And I've come to prophesy over your life that tonight it will be broken in the name of Jesus. Sir. Tonight the Lord will surely set you free in the name of the. Please get somebody to join. Get somebody to join. Because tonight, uh, yesterday we prayed for our loved ones. Yesterday we prayed for our loved ones. But tonight uh, I will be praying for you. And towards the end, I will minister a little bit tonight. And so please get somebody on board. Like it. Share it. Uh, and then it's called electronic evangelism. Anytime you like it. You are potentially reaching out to somebody. Anytime you share it, you are potentially reaching out to somebody. It's a way of evangelism. I mean, so please do so and the Lord will bless you. So like it now if you haven't. Like it now if you haven't. And the Lord will bless you. Please let's turn our Bibles uh, to the scripture that we were looking at yesterday, which is First Chronicles chapter 4, verse 10. I mean, I've given you another definition of what a limitation is. And we want to look at somebody's life, a very popular story in the Bible. First Chronicles chapter 4, verse 10. First Chronicles chapter 4, verse 10. It says, And Jabed called on the God of Israel, saying, Oh, that you will bless me indeed, and enlarge my territory, that your hand will be with me, and that you will keep me from evil that I may not cause pain. So God granted him what he requested. Tonight, uh, may the God who answered Jabez's prayers, uh, may the same God answer your prayer tonight. May the God of Papa Abraham, may the God of Papa Isaac, may the God of Papa Jacob or Israel uh, answer your prayer tonight uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. Um, amen and amen and amen. 
praise the Lord. Amen. It's a very sto a story about a man called Jabez. Now, Jabez means, uh, uh, simply put, Jabez means pain. Amen. His mother was going to give birth to him. Uh, and for one reason or the other, we don't know exactly what happened. We don't know exactly what happened, but it is very possible. It is very possible that at the time she was going through pain, it's possible that at the time something was frustrating her life. At the time, it's possible that she was so angry that she didn't even care about her son. And so she gave him the name Jabez. In other words, as I said earlier on, a spiritual embargo was placed upon him right from the day he was born so though an honorable man but nothing seems to work for him though he was created to be great but nothing seems to work for him because of the embargo that his mother placed on him at birth and many of us will be surprised uh, you'd be surprised what happened to you when you were given when you were giving birth to you. Some of you will even be surprised what happened to you when your mother was carrying you in the womb. You'll be surprised why your father and mother took you too while you were in your mother's womb. You'll be surprised. Some of you will be surprised to discover that even mommy or daddy were going through challenges at the time and while you were pregnant in the womb, they visited the shrine. And an embargo may have been placed on you as a result of that. Amen. Amen. And as a result of that, you find out that you are restricted in life. You are limited in some areas of your life. It might not be you, but it could be a brother or sister or a cousin or a nephew or a neighbor um, whom you have experienced that they are experiencing certain things in their life. And you are standing in for them tonight. Please get them to join. Get them to join tonight. Amen. So, he, so he found out that he was restricted. Yesterday, we looked at um, we looked at verse part of verse ten, where he said he told God to enlarge his territory. Where he told God to enlarge his territory. In other words, he had his territory had been limited as a result of the embargo that was placed upon him. Many of you will be surprised to discover that the lifestyle you are living now is what somebody said about you. You'll be surprised. You'll be surprised. I remember one guy who was at university and he bought um, a brand new computer and somebody was very jealous of the fact that he bought a computer and the person said to him that that computer would just be a box in your house. The person said that the computer you bought will be a, just a box in your house. In other words, you will not be able to make use of it. And the guy said, from that moment onwards, anytime he sat behind the computer to do his assignment, he could not do it. In fact, he nearly failed the course. And then we had to pray for him. He couldn't even, in fact, he wouldn't have been able to complete the degree because of what that person said. He took it as a joke, but it was an embargo that was placed upon him or placed upon his education. And many of you will be surprised to discover that what you are seeing in your life or your loved one's life is what somebody said. It's what somebody said that has placed a limitation on you. But tonight, uh, it doesn't matter what they said. Amen. The Bible says that greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. Amen. We are going to revoke it tonight and the Lord will surely restore you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. If you typed amen or shouted amen where you are, then you are the one I'm prophesying to tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So that is what had happened to Jabez. A spiritual embargo had been placed on him. Amen. And he was prohibited. He was prevented. He was limited. Amen. A, a spiritual boundary had been placed around him, so he could not go beyond that boundary. And so he had to pray for God to enlarge his coast. What this means is that sometimes you know that you can achieve more than you are doing now. And you know it. Sometimes you see your loved one and you know they can do more than they are doing now. But somehow something is restricting them. But tonight, may the Lord set you free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. If you shouted amen where you are, or if you typed amen, then you are the one I'm prophesying to tonight.
You know, you know that you are performing below your potential. You know. But somehow, anytime you try it, something pushes you back. Or it could be a, it could be it could be a family member that you've noticed that uh, they are they're performing below their potentials. And they, they, they want to, but they can't. Something just pushes them back. It's an embargo. And tonight I break and destroy that embargo in the name of Jesus Christ. And I release you to fulfill your divine purpose in the mighty name of Jesus. May the Lord enlarge your territory as he did for Jabez in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Tonight I'm angry in my spirit. I'm provoked in my spirit. Somebody please uh, make sure you get a loved one to join because I need to mention somebody's name and pray for the Lord to set them free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen, amen, amen. The mother said, because he bore him in pain, he gave him that name. Amen. But the Lord will deliver you. So he asked that the Lord will bless him indeed. When you are limited, blessing is very far from you. What we call blessing. I, I met somebody. Um, I, 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 I met somebody who told me that pastor, and the person is in, is in their 60s, and the person told me that pastor, this thing called joy, I have never experienced it in my life. I, I felt sorry for the person. He said this thing called joy. I have never experienced it in my life. You see, and it tends to happen when there's a spiritual embargo. So he asked the Lord to bless me. He hadn't experienced blessings in his life before. He only heard other people's testimonies. And there are, some of you are like that. You only hear people's testimonies. And sometimes you even begin to doubt whether the testimony is true or not. Because you have never given one yourself before. It's a limitation. It's a limitation. It's a, lim it's a spiritual embargo. That denies you your testimony. And tonight, by the power of the blood of Jesus, I destroy it and I release you to succeed. I release you tonight to excel. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I have prayed tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Please get somebody on board. Get somebody on board. Like it and share it. The least you can do is to like and share it so that you can reach out to somebody who might be in Jabez situation tonight. So he prayed for the Lord to bless him. And tonight you will experience blessings. The time for you to share your own testimony uh, is now in the name of Jesus Christ. I mean, you've heard other people's testimony. But from tonight onwards, you will also have reasons to stand before the people of God and praise the name of the Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I have prayed. Amen and amen and amen. Praise the Lord. So he prayed that the Lord would bless him indeed and enlarge his territory. I'm going to stop there because our time is far gone. I will continue with the rest tomorrow night. Amen. I'll, because tonight God is going to bless somebody. Say in the name of Jesus Christ. Now please, I want you to be serious. Try not to be distracted. I mean, try not to be distracted. I mean, try not to be distracted. And believe every word that you are going to declare tonight because whatever you say is exactly what is going to happen. It's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time. Uh, what you say is exactly what is going to happen. Amen. Today we had a service with Prophet uh, Morris. And, and some things I declared in the middle of the night. Before the service today. It's exactly what I saw in the service. It's exactly. I won't tell you what it is. Because there are some forest gate people on board. So I won't say exactly what it is. But exactly what I declared in the middle of the night concerning the service. It's exactly what I saw in today's service. Amen. You are very powerful. You are very powerful. Amen. So you are going to pray now. Believe everything you declare. Amen. And it shall surely come to pass. If you are not seeing now, just hang on. Just hang on. Don't give up. Joseph's dream did not materialize immediately. Amen. 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 But he remained strong. He never wavered. Amen. So please don't worry. If you are not seeing it, it will surely come to pass. It has been programmed in the spiritual realm and nothing can stop it. I mean, say in the name of Jesus, 
tonight by the power of the blood of jesus i destroy any spiritual embargo responsible for limitation in my life or my loved one's life or my bloodline i destroy it say in the name of jesus let's take this prayer again say in the name of jesus i destroy any i destroy any spiritual embargo responsible for limitation in any area of my life and my bloodline i destroy it tonight for the third time please repeat it after me while you are please repeat it after me i believe in the prayer of agreement uh, say in the name of jesus christ say tonight uh, I, by the power of the blood of jesus uh, i destroy any spiritual embargo responsible for limitation uh, working against me and my loved ones uh, and members of my bloodline i destroy it in the name of jesus christ i destroy the embargo in the name of jesus christ and i declare that we are free in the mighty name of jesus christ somebody lift up your voice uh, and begin to pray if you can clap where you are put your hands together and also clap as you are praying something is happening tonight something is something is happening tonight something is happening tonight the lord is doing a new thing in your life tonight somebody intensify your prayer tonight somebody intensify your prayer tonight call somebody get somebody on board tonight get somebody on board tonight tonight i want to mention your names and also have time to minister that to you and therefore get somebody on board tonight pray against that any spiritual embargo pray against any spiritual embargo working against you or a loved one or members of your bloodline begin to pray against it somebody begin to pray against it somebody begin to pray against it lift that embargo tonight we lift that embargo tonight permanently we lift and destroy that embargo over your bloodline we lift and destroy that uh, embargo over your family in the name of jesus christ somebody Somebody begin to pray. 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 Intensify your prayer. Intensify your prayer. You are doing so well tonight. You are doing so well tonight. Put your hands together where you are, if possible. If you're not going to disturb a neighbor, then put your hands together and begin to pray and begin to pray. Begin to pray. Destroy any embargo. Destroy any embargo working against your destiny working against your loved ones uh, in the name of jesus christ somebody continue to pray 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 mazagada brosigragada gada gada regregede gregede gede somebody pray tonight somebody pray tonight somebody pray tonight sakata bro gada 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 regede bro zigra gada gada hey magra gada gra gada gada ragada gra gada gregede gede rande gregede bro zigra gada hey magra gada regede gede gede magra gada somebody destroy you are destroying any embargo uh, limiting your life uh. you are destroying any embargo limiting your son your daughter any embargo um, limiting your spouse uh, begin to destroy tonight any embargo limiting your grandchildren begin to destroy tonight any embargo limiting your ministry your career begin to destroy tonight any embargo limiting your business uh, begin to destroy tonight any embargo limiting uh, your finances begin to destroy tonight somebody intensify your prayer tonight uh, somebody intensify your prayer tonight uh, somebody intensify your prayer tonight Tonight, uh, continue to pray continue to like and share it uh, even as you are praying somebody intensify your prayer tonight somebody intensify your prayer tonight somebody intensify your prayer tonight destroy that embargo destroy that embargo somebody pray somebody pray somebody pray somebody pray intensify your prayer tonight intensify your prayer tonight magra gada 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 hey Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Ragada Randa Somebody pray. Somebody pray tonight. Somebody continue to pray. You are doing exceptionally well tonight. Continue to pray. Ragada Gregede. Ragada 
Ragada brozi gragada maza gada gada gada. Somebody continue to pray. Somebody continue to pray. Somebody continue to pray. You are praying and destroying any embargo, any embargo, any embargo limiting any area of your life. Begin to pray against it. Dismantle it tonight. Dismantle it tonight. We lift that embargo permanently over you and your household in the name of Jesus. I remove that embargo permanently tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody count you to pray. Ragragada gregede. Legregede gregede gede gede. Ragragada brose gregede gede gede gede. Mazagragada rede gregede gede. Somebody intensify your prayer. Call somebody, get them to join because very soon I'll be mentioning names and I'll be praying for you tonight. Somebody continue uh, to pray tonight. Hey, magragada brose gragada gada gada. Breze gede 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 gede. Mazigragada rede gregede. In Jesus mighty name Amen and Amen and Amen We are still dealing with any embargo limiting you Amen Now I, I, as we did yesterday This time I want you to mention Specific areas of your life For about three minutes or so Amen Specific areas of your life Where you may be experiencing that embargo Amen It could be an embargo on marriage Amen An embargo on marriage Where people are not able to marry at all Or you marry but can't sustain the marriage I say it again Where you are not able to marry at all Or marriage is not a problem You get married But somehow you will not be able to sustain it It's a form of embargo Amen Pray against it And it could be your finances uh, Sometimes uh, difficult to make money at all In any shape or form You make money Something happens And you lose the money Amen As the, with a woman with the issue of blood Amen You make money and you lose it. Or uh, sometimes you can't even make it at all Amen. It's an embargo. Pray against any embargo against your marriage, your finances, and any particular area of your life uh, that you may have witnessed. This is just for two minutes. Uh, and then every night we'll try to do the same thing. Amen. And then we'll move on. Any area of your life, make sure you don't just pray in the spirit. Mention it. Speak into the, speak into the atmosphere. Amen. Speak into the atmosphere. Amen. Don't just pray in the spirit, but say it out. Say it out loudly and destroy it. Amen. Say in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, tonight, uh, say in the name of Jesus Christ. Any embargo of divorce, any embargo of singlehood, any embargo on my finances, any embargo on my health, any embargo on my ministry, any embargo on my education, and any area of my life, I destroy tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. I've mentioned just a few, but whatever you have experienced, you are experiencing in your life or in the family, begin to pray and leave that embargo that is limiting members of your family in that particular area of their lives begin to pray right now huh? you are doing so well tonight you are doing so well tonight somebody can't to pray please get everybody on board call all your sisters call all your brothers send them the link get them to join tonight could make a, a huge difference in their lives huh? amen so get them on board get them on board begin to pray somebody begin to pray somebody begin to pray somebody begin to pray you are doing so well tonight you are doing so well tonight Somebody pray tonight. Somebody pray. You are doing so well tonight. You are doing so well tonight. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Mention it. Call it by name. Don't just pray in the spirit. Call it by name for the next few seconds. Uh, call it by name. Call it by name. Call it by name and destroy it in the name of Jesus Christ. Hey, my God. For the next few seconds, please do that for me. Do that for me. Call it by name. Don't just pray in the spirit, but call it by name. Whatever you have identified, destroy the embargo. Destroy that particular embargo in the name of Jesus Christ. And as you declare it tonight, so shall it be for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. 
somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, intensify your prayer, intensify your prayer tonight, intensify your prayer tonight. Mezi gragada, brozi gragada, gada, 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 eh, ma gragada, brozi gragada, gada, gada. In Jesus' mighty name, uh, we have prayed. Uh, amen and amen. You are and amen. You are doing so well. Uh, but please get somebody on board. Get somebody. If you haven't liked it yet, be, please like it now. It's a form of evangelism. If you haven't shared it yet, uh, please do so now. Do so now. It's a form of evangelism, and the Lord will bless you. So Jabez prayed that the Lord will bless him indeed he said that you will bless me indeed and then an embargo can be placed on your blessings so this thing called blessings that we keep saying you may have never experienced it before an embargo can be placed on your blessings Amen. So all your life, all you experience in your life is struggling struggling you you cause everything is a struggle nothing comes to you easy amen it, 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 it's an embargo I know some people, somebody's life that is always full of pain. Amen. And in fact, I know somebody who was telling me that every year somebody dies in the family. Somebody close to her dies in the family. And it happens on a particular date. Amen. A particular date of the year, somebody must die in the family. On a particular date of the year, somebody dies. Amen. You are going to pray against it. Uh, you are going to pray against any embargo placed on your blessings. Amen. So Jabez prayed that the Lord will bless him indeed. Amen. And the Lord began to bless him. Tonight the Lord will bless you. Amen. Amen. And I know something uh, so that some of you find out that because of that, when, when somebody has been sent to, to be a blessing to you, amen. You see, when this embargo is upon your life, they cannot bless you because there's something about you that becomes an irritation for them not to help you. I'll say it again. When this embargo is working against your blessings, when people are sent to be a blessing to you, either um, a wealthy person or somebody who can help you to get what you need to do, they are sent to bless you. And you know they've come into your life and you think that this is it. But something about you becomes an irritation so that they cannot help you. It's, it's an embargo. Something about you becomes an irritation and then they withdraw from you suddenly. When, when this uh, 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 limitation is also operating against you, you get so close to the blessing, but you are not able to touch it. You get so close, but you're not able to touch it. Uh, somebody was telling me how, how somebody had willed so many lands to her. The lands were there, but up to now, the person doesn't have access to the lands. Because of some litigations that are going on. Can see the land, but can't take it. When this embargo is operating against your blessing, that's what happens. And tonight, I want you to be angry for the next few minutes. Amen. Uh, very soon, I want to start mentioning your names early today because tonight, I want to mention everyone's name. Amen. So you are going to pray against any embargo operating against your blessing. As I, I've given you some examples of what this could mean. When your life is, everything about your life is a struggle. Every time you, you every week or something, you go through some kind of pain. When people are sent to bless you, and you know that this person can help you, but suddenly something about you becomes an irritation so that they will not bless you. It's a sign. Or sometimes you see the blessing, but you're not able to touch it. You're not able to take it. You see it from afar. It's a limitation on your blessing. And tonight you are going to pray that the Lord will release your blessing tonight. And believe me, if you pray this prayer genuinely, you will begin to see the hand of God upon your life. Say in the name of Jesus, sir. Say in the name of Jesus, any embargo on my blessings, sir, I destroy it tonight. In the name of Jesus, sir. Say, oh Lord, that you bless me tonight. Say, oh Lord, that you bless me tonight. Say, oh Lord, that you bless me tonight. Say, tonight I destroy any embargo operating against my blessings. In the name of Jesus. And also declare tonight that Lord bless me tonight. Say, Oh Lord, bless me tonight. Now lift up your voice and begin to pray. Begin to pray. I'm going to start mentioning your names. I want to start mentioning your names early tonight. Somebody begin to pray. Somebody begin to pray. Somebody begin to pray. Call somebody to join tonight. Hey. 
Call somebody to join tonight. Call somebody to join tonight. Somebody intensify your prayer. Any limitation against your blessings, uh, begin to pray. Any embargo on your blessings, uh, begin to pray. Destroy tonight. Destroy tonight. Destroy tonight. Destroy tonight. Destroy tonight. Destroy tonight. Intensify your prayer tonight. Intensify your prayer tonight. Intensify your prayer tonight. And at the same time, you are praying that the Lord will bless you. That the God who restored the Jabez will restore you tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, somebody intensify your prayer. Very soon, I will start mentioning your names. Uh, please, when I mention your name for five minutes, don't type again. Uh, so that I can mention everybody's name. Uh, amen. And if for some reasons, if for some reasons, you are not able to type. Uh, if you are not able to type, my number is right there on the screen. Uh, my number is right there on the screen. Uh, send me just the name. Don't add a message to it. If you add a message to it, I might miss it amen because i tend to get a lot of messages on whatsapp amen. so just the name just your name just type the name and send it to me via whatsapp if for some reasons you can't type uh, amen do so and i'll pray for you tonight and the hand of god will come upon you the hand of god will come upon you tonight the hand of god will come upon you tonight the hand of god that came upon jabez uh, will come upon you tonight uh, the hand of god that was with jabez uh, will come upon you tonight it's coming upon you tonight it's coming upon your loved ones tonight it's setting you free tonight uh, it's opening doors for you tonight somebody begin to pray tonight like never before her. in the name of jesus uh, larissa may the god uh, who blessed jabez bless you tonight in the name of the tamara prayer uh, may the lord bless you tonight uh, in the name of the efua epicin and your household may the lord bless you tonight in the name of jesus christ uh, nana efua and jude and the family may the lord bless you tonight in the name of jesus beatrice Brobe. may the lord Lord bless you tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody continue to pray. Please, once I mention your name, don't type for another five minutes. Uh, amen. This will give me time to mention everyone's name. Somebody continue to pray. Somebody continue to pray. Crystal Cheney Marco, may the Lord bless you tonight uh, in the name of Jesus. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the F4 person. Uh, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight uh, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody continue to pray. Minister Kinsley Ejekuma, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of jesus christ esther amma may the lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of jesus christ matthew mensa may the lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of jesus whoever ac milan is uh, may the lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of jesus christ tenny and jola may the lord bless you tonight indeed in the name of jesus christ angela ayite may the lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of this felicia question May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the OWR Bright. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Mama Lydia, we are faith. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray. Andy Mensa, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Stella Owusu, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Pastor Ebi Mensa. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Sister Philomena Opoku Bwati, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight. In the name of the Mama Florence Jima, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight. In the mighty name of the Comfort Mensa Bunsu, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight. In the name of the Mama Agnes Quartin, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ, uh, and Deborah, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ, Julius Cora, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ, uh, somebody continue to pray. Even when I mention your name, don't go away. I want to minister before we close. Esther Odinga. May the Lord bless you, Esther Odinga. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight. Esther Odinga, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Hey, my God, Mama Gladys Benson and your household. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Mama Teresa and Champo and your household. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Emmanuel David and Champo. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Mama Yadufie. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Harriet Asari. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody come to pray. Mama Grace Samaneka. Mama Grace Samaneka and your household members. May the Lord bless you in 
indeed tonight in the name of the Paul Utre. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Brago Asante. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Jemia Faith Mofa. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Francisca R. Bangura. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Jaden Latte. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Esther and Pofowa. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Mami Bosno Apia Menka. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Joel Kazadi. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Adua Aduma. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Ade and Ola. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the baby Abna. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Justina Peters. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Gladys Entry. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Mama Teresa Donko. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Mama Juliana Nimo. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Harold and Kemi. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Jesus Christ. Janet Rita Mensa. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Minister Sarah Cornelius. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Mary Anang. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the Pastor James Adjimandia. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of Jesus. Clarice Kofi. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Daisy Kingston, uh, Joshua Kingston, and the entire family. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Ajua Atta. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Jamil Latte. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Cecilia Nyamiche. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Mama Constance Fusua. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Lisa Pompokwa and Lucy. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of of the MD and Mama Evelyn Boatima and the family. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody continue to pray. My Quetia, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray tonight. Somebody pray tonight. My God, Uncle Lee Johnson and your household. May the Lord bless you indeed in the name of Jesus. Richard Amenyampo and Quinster and the family. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Kojo Ose Bando. May the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, somebody continue to pray. Uh, somebody continue to pray. Uh, somebody continue to pray. Uh, if for some reasons you can't type, uh, you can send me your name on WhatsApp uh, and I'll mention your name and pray for you. Andy, Andy, uh, may the Lord bless you indeed tonight uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, Beatrice Brobe, the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of Jesus. Mama Hannah Naughty, the Lord bless you indeed tonight uh, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody the country to pray. You are praying tonight that the Lord will bless you indeed. You are praying tonight that the Lord will bless you indeed. Mama Eheti Ashford Amisa, the Lord bless you indeed in the name of Jesus. Sir Batmambu Bankwantima, the Lord bless you indeed in the mighty name of Jesus. A queer entry, the Lord bless you indeed in the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody intensify your prayer tonight. Francisca Albangura, the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Loretta Lewis, the Lord bless Bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Rita Awuve, the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody intensify your prayer. Gladys Anang, the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus. Pastor Vida Akugolu and Delagolu, I pray for you tonight. Delagolu, receive the blessing of the Lord in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I have prayed. Somebody continue to pray. Somebody intensify your prayer tonight. Somebody intensify your prayer tonight. Somebody intensify your prayer tonight. It's getting very hot tonight. Uh, Lydia, the Lord bless you in your household indeed tonight. In the name of your Sandra Asare Amankwa and your household Sandra, may the Lord bless you tonight. Sandra, receive the blessings of the Lord tonight. Sandra, may tonight be your night. Receive the blessings of the Lord tonight. In the name of Jesus, Eric Amwako and your household. Uh, the Lord bless you tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, please don't go away yet. Keep praying. Get somebody to join. A queer entry. I pray for you again. The Lord bless you indeed tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you Lord tonight. We give you the glory for answer prayers. In Jesus mighty name we have prayed. Amen and amen and amen. Amen. Regina Ousu, the Lord bless you indeed tonight. In Jesus mighty name we have prayed. Amen.
God bless you. Now listen to this. If I've mentioned your name already, don't type. If I've mentioned your name at least once, my pastor Joseph Matonda, the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. The Martin Princess, the Lord bless you indeed tonight in the name of the pastor Doris Ajimendria. The Lord bless you indeed tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hey, ragada brosi ragada. Receive your blessings tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. I have prayed. Amen and amen and amen mama mariam fimbo the lord is blessing you tonight in the name of jesus the struggle is over mama mariam fimbo the struggle is over your latter years will be far greater than the former in the mighty name of mama mariam fimbo receive your blessings tonight in jesus mighty name i have prayed rita Aouve, receive the blessings of the lord tonight in the name of jesus christ amen and amen and amen now, now please if I've mentioned your name at least once, if I've mentioned your name at least once, don't type. Just lift up your hands unto the Lord. I mean, some strange things are going to happen to some of you. You'll be surprised. Sister Daniel, the Lord bless you tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Now, if I've mentioned your name at least once, just lift up your hands tonight and receive it. Lift up your two hands. Don't type again. If I've mentioned your name at least once, don't type again. Just lift up your hands. Lift up your hands unto the Lord and receive it tonight. If I've mentioned your name at least once, and then don't type again. Just lift up your hands unto the Lord and receive your breakthrough tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, all kinds of strange stuff are, are going to be happening to some of you. Some of you are going to have some unusual encounters tonight just to confirm that the Lord has heard your prayer tonight ragada brosi ragada right now it's happening to you right now as you lift up your two hands may the power of the holy ghost but i gotta descend very strongly upon you where you are now in the name of Jesus. number one number two number three number four number five number six number seven receive power now to do what you couldn't do before evangelist etienne kwa enjoy receive the blessings of the lord tonight now just lift up your two hands if i've mentioned your name at least once right now the power of the holy ghost is coming very strongly upon you where you are tonight the the power of the Holy Ghost is visiting you right now in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, limitation is being broken tonight. In the name of your freedom is taking place tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, receive it now. When I said receive it now, somebody nearly fell over. There is somebody who nearly fell over. When I said receive it now, you nearly fell over. And God is just reassuring you that He's with you and He has not given up on you. Receive it now in the name of jesus christ mabel amofa receive the blessings of the lord tonight in the name of jesus christ now just lift up your two hands unto the lord tonight just lift up your two hands unto the lord tonight i want to see i want to hear your experiences or type your experiences right now the power of god is coming so strongly upon some of you there'll be all kinds of strength there in fact there are all kinds of strange manifestations going on now there are all kinds of strange manifestations going on now. Receive power now. Receive power. I, I break that. I, I break the limits. I break the limits. I break the limits. I lift the yoke. I lift the burden. I destroy the yoke and lift the burden. I destroy the yoke and lift the burden. I destroy the embargo tonight in the name of Jesus. And I release you to succeed tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Not in the name of Stephen, uh, but in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive it tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Now keep your two hands lifted. Keep your two hands lifted. The power of God is visiting some of you so strongly tonight. The power of God is visiting some of you so strongly tonight. Just lift up your hand. They don't type. If I've mentioned your name at least once, don't type. Just lift up your two hands. Please, it's important that you follow spiritual instructions. Satan is good at distracting you. If I've mentioned your name, don't type. Just lift up your two hands. Just lift up your two hands and receive it. Sika, Sika, uh, Sita, Sika, Sita. Receive the blessings of the Lord tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Your name will follow you in the name of Jesus. Just lift up your two hands right now lift up your two hands and receive it now lift up the Nevada do Rosario receive the blessings of the Lord tonight in the name of Jesus Christ lift up your two hands right now now there are all kinds of stuff going on right now if I've mentioned your name at least once don't type don't type just follow my instructions tonight the Lord is visiting you tonight the Lord is visiting you tonight where you are now there's a visitation I see somebody crying tears coming down tears coming down tears coming down the Lord is visiting you tonight the Lord is visiting you 
you tonight. The Lord is visiting you to receive it now in the name of Jesus Christ. Hey, any demonic altar empowering the embargo, I silence the voice of that altar perpetually but with the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. It can no longer speak against you. It can no longer limit you. It can no longer limit members of your family in the name of Jesus Christ. Be free tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Now, please, I, I want you to type your experiences. Uh, what is what is happening to you now? Because I need to mention your name and pray for you. Magraga. Just type, uh, type it. Just, just, I, want to hear, I want a couple of you to type at least, to type what, what is happening to you where you are now. There's somebody, I saw tears coming down. Uh, there's a lady, tears coming down. If you are the one, just type T. Type T for tears. Type T for tears. Or whatever is happening to you. Some of you are coughing. Some of you, somebody nearly fell over there. The power of God was so strong upon your life. I want you to type type your experiences now on the screen. And I want to mention your name and pray for you. Whatever is happening to you right now, type it right now. And believe. I want you to also believe your prayer. Sisi Mambu Bankwantima, I see a big hand wiping your tears away. Sisi Mambu Bankwantima, I see a big hand wiping your tears away. Right, right, right now, receive it now. Your victory tonight. Sisi Mambu, receive it now. Sisi Mambu, receive your victory tonight. Uh, and Larissa says she was the one who nearly fell. Larissa, the Lord is restoring you tonight. Larissa received divine restoration tonight. And Maharet Asari said she also she, she also had tears. Magraga Dagada. Asari, uh, the, the, the days of sorrow are over. The days of tears are over. Uh, your, your joy has come. Your joy has come. Harriet uh, Asari receive it tonight. Uh, Larissa says she was also coughing. I repeat that in hindering you, uh, Larissa. In the name of Jesus, and Deborah also, Deborah also, the Lord has wiped your tears away. In the name of the Clarice, Coffee says she was itching on both knee. Magra gada gada, Clarice, the time of struggles are over. The times that you have been struggling are over. The struggling time is over. It's over. The Lord is doing anything in your life. Clarice, Coffee, receive it now. Mama Teresa, Champo says she was shaking. Mama Teresa, the Lord uh, empower you. The Lord re-energize you. The Lord revive every organ in your body. In the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, Mata Bempa said there were burning sensations. Uh, Mata Bempa received power to do what you couldn't do for. Mama Julia Nimo said that the tears were coming. My grandmama Julia Nimo, the Lord is wiping your tears away. But I got, I got, uh, your joy has come. Mama Julia Nimo, receive it now. In the name of Andy Mensa also said he almost fell. My grandma, uh, Andy, you are very anointed. Andy, you are very anointed. And anything that is limiting the anointing upon your life, Andy Mensa has been broken tonight. In the name of you, receive power to do what you couldn't do before, Andy. Receive power Power to do what you couldn't before, Andy. Receive power to do what you couldn't do before, Andy. Receive it tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hey, Matthew says he was shaken. Magragada, Matthew, I also hear the same thing. Matthew, receive power tonight. Matthew, receive power. Matthew, power to move forward. Power to make progress in your life. Matthew, Mensa is coming upon you tonight. Receive it in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Magragada, Brunzi, Gragada. Hey, Magode, Brunzi, Gragada, Gada, Gada. Father, we thank you tonight. We thank you for a strong visitation tonight. Lord all right, Louis said her two hands are very heavy. My God, my God, it's the anointing that has come upon you tonight. Loretta, the anointing has come upon you. Loretta, you were supposed to be very powerful in ministry, but the enemy tried to limit you. Amen. And that's what the Lord is telling you tonight. Loretta, I release you. It doesn't matter how old you are. May the Lord use you to bring, bring glory to his name. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Francisca Abangra says, sharp shooting pain in her left arm and tingling in the finger tips of her right hand also. Magragadagada. Uh, Francesca, receive divine restoration in every area of your life. Divine restoration in your health and every area of your life. Uh, Francesca Albangura, receive it now. Lift up your two hands, Francesca. Re lift up your two hands and receive it now. Lift up your two hands and receive it now. Lift up your two hands. You'll be a wonder. You, your, your life will be a wonder. Francesca Albangura, mark it down. Believe the report of the Lord. Francesca Albangura, your life will be a wonder for the whole world to see. In the name of you, receive it tonight. In the the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you tonight. Father, we give you glory tonight for such a visitation tonight. Father, I thank you for setting your people free. Father, I thank you for extending their coast tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. We give you all the glory, Lord, tonight and we give you the praise. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed tonight. Amen and amen and amen. Somebody put your hands together where you are. 
Put your hands together where you are. Just put your hands together to the glory of the Lord. Where you are, where you are, where you are. It's a spiritual exercise. Please do it for me now, please. Uh, put your hands together to the glory of the Lord where you are. Put your hands together to the glory of the Lord where you are. As you are clapping, as you are clapping, God is also clapping. As you are clapping, God is also clapping. And the camp of the enemy is being destroyed. The camp of the enemy is falling apart perpetually. As you are clapping unto the Lord, as you are praising the Lord, as you are clapping tonight the lord is also clapping Magra gada gada gada. and anything that may have been shut against you has opened tonight in the name of jesus get ready to give your testimony get ready to share your testimony get ready to tell your testimony sika said that she had headache before she joined us but she has been healed tonight father i thank you i repeat that headache sika and i command the headache never to come back again in the name of jesus christ hey, Magra, receive your healing tonight perpetual healing anybody else who is sick tonight also receive your healing tonight in the mighty name of jesus christ father we thank you tonight we give you the glory for answered prayers tonight hey, in jesus mighty name we have prayed uh, amen and amen and amen Amen. Amen. Father, we thank you tonight. Father, we give you the glory for answer prayers tonight. Uh, I pray for Andy. Andy, receive the blessings of the Lord. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And amen. God bless you all for joining our time is up. As I said earlier on, tonight, tomorrow night, I'll be back again. Amen. We were still dealing with Jabez tomorrow night. I mean, we are still dealing with limitations throughout the month of August. And the Lord is telling me that by the time you enter September, many of you will begin to give unusual testimonies. Amen. You begin to see the hand of the Lord in every area of your life in the name of Jesus. So please do your best to be part of it. Tomorrow night we are also on. And also, more importantly, on Thursday, Thursday we have prayer of Jabez in person. It's a special summer edition. A prayer of Jabez in person. And it starts uh, this Thursday. It starts um, um, uh, um, this this Thursday. Let me give you all the dates. It starts this Thursday. I mean, this Thursday, the 11th of, um, uh, 11th of August. So it's going to be the 11th of August, 18th of August, 25th of august and then the first of september i said again the 11th of august 18th of august 25th of august and the first of september and then every thursday is a special summer edition we'll meet in person only in person only at our headquarters i mean at 11 a.m at 11 a.m it's a special summer edition please make sure you come with somebody we saw how god moved tonight just imagine what will happen when we meet in person and then and if you can if you can you're not on medication or you're not pregnant uh, or, 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 or anything of that sort uh, then please try to fast for three days tomorrow tuesday uh, 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 and 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 wednesday using first chronicles chapter 4 verse 10 using first chronicles chapter 4 verse 10 using first chronicles chapter 4 verse 10 and uh, use that to fast monday tuesday wednesday amen and then we'll meet in person on thursday at our headquarters a uh, prayer temple at our headquarters i'm expecting all of you to be there some of you have to buy your ticket and come it's going to be powerful it's going to be awesome and man be part of it and the lord will bless you and man we will still meet on tuesday on zoom so it doesn't take away the tuesday meeting on zoom that one will still go ahead that one will also go ahead and man so i hope to see you all on thursday at 11 a.m and if you can join me tonight at 2 a.m also to pray in the spirit at 2 a.m we do that every night and join me tonight my phone number is on the screen if you need further details uh, just whatsapp me or send me a direct text message and i'll do my best to respond to you i mean god bless you once again i really appreciate you all and all the pastors uh, who made time to join us tonight the lord bless you all the lord bless you all for making time to be with us tonight i hope that you've been blessed amen i hope you've been blessed i know that you have been blessed i know that you have been blessed i know you have been blessed amen and so please we are going to share the grace now and then we are going to close father i thank you for tonight lord i give you the glory for answered prayers tonight i thank you lord for blessing everyone who joined us tonight in the name of the lord i thank you for destroying every limitation in the name of jesus Lord, we give you all the glory lord and we give you all the praise in jesus mighty name we have prayed amen thank you for the prayers i appreciate you all also and if you need special prayers or you want me to pray for somebody send me a message on whatsapp those of you who sent the names last night you noticed that i responded amen and i, I typed their names and responded 
responded to your messages uh, you need a special prayer or you want me to pray for somebody um, in particular just send me um the, the details on my whatsapp and tonight throughout the night i'll be praying for you god bless you i love you all and i'll see you all again tomorrow night at the same time god bless you and good night bye god bless you bye thank you for joining thank you for blessing me also thank you all god bless you all bye god bless you all. bye bye god bless you bye